welcome back to my channel. My name's Chantel. This is my basic journey and today we're going to be working on my van. As you can see, I have a piece of plywood in here. I'm actually going to be measuring how big I need to get it cut and then we're going to go to Jerry's. So a few weeks ago when I was last working on my van, I spray painted my vanity white. That's what I'm going to be using for storage. I need a way to secure it down on the floor. So I'm going to take the piece of plywood that was like a spare piece and cut it so that it will be the right dimensions for this space. That way I can like use L brackets to put my vanity on so it won't like fly up <laughs> if I like stop really quick or anything. So we're going to go to Jerry's right now which is kind of like a Home Depot but it's local and they'll price match anything. So also they cut stuff which the Home Depot that's by me will not cut anything for me. So I'm also gonna try to find something to make a closet out of. I'm thinking like some steel piping. I don't know. We're just gonna look and see what we can find. I don't really have a plan for that. So let's go to Jerry's. done at Jerry's I got everything that I needed I just need to go get my pipe cut and the plywood cut and so I'm gonna drive back there get those cut and then we'll be done <laughs> falling asleep and not doing this last night so <laughs> um, I'm doing it today and so I'm gonna show you everything that I got and kind of explain what I'm gonna do with everything first and then I'll kind of show you me going through that process so that's my bag from Jerry's and that's the plywood that I got cut to 18 inches and so I'm just actually gonna put it there now so I got that cut to be 18 inches right there and so it'll fit perfectly in the back. That way my vanity will have something flat to sit on. So here's everything that I got from Jerry's. I'm gonna kind of explain everything. So I first got this PVC pipe and I got it cut to the dimensions. I'm gonna make a closet out of it. You guys will see how I do that. I kind of just went all willy nilly with it, not gonna lie, I have no idea what I'm doing. So I just kind of drew something out and am hoping for the best. And so these, these, and these steel things all kind of go with that. This is the glue that'll melt those together. And then I also got these L brackets for which I'm going to put up against these things as well as on the vanity to hold this down. So that way if I do have to stop quickly or if anything were to happen, I'm not going to have my vanity flying to the front seat. I also, for other mini side projects, got some Gorilla Glue and some Velcro because sometimes these window coverings do not want to stay up. So I figured I would put some Velcro on it so they'll stay up there. So the first thing I'm going to do is put my vanity in here and nail it down with these. Actually, the first thing I'm gonna do is screw these in to here because the vanity will be over that somewhere. So I'm gonna nail those down. We'll try and screw them in actually. 
but yeah so we're gonna do that first I'm having quite a bit of trouble so I'm gonna go see if my neighbor has a drill um, because I cannot get to seem to like make it hammer in What's this? <laughs> um, so I'm gonna go try to see if one of them have a drill that I could use so he didn't have a screwdriver or a drill but he told me just to hammer this in a little bit and then pull it out and then I'll be able to screw in manually with my screwdriver put these screws in So I've officially finished one. I'm going to do the two other legs and then I'll catch you guys up then. So it's a bit of a mess down here, but I finally got the other two done and I put the vanity back here. And so I do want to put a filing cabinet underneath this and I don't know if it's going to fit with that. And so I might have to remove that thing. Otherwise it fits great. And then I'm just going to put the other L brackets on this side like that so I'm going to go grab my filing cabinet and bring it out here okay so I did have to break off the back support and then I also had to break off these things which were like in here so like that or something and I had to pull those out but it fits and so now the moment of truth I'm gonna try and close this sweet it totally closes everything's good I did leave my keys in there though that secure in place I'm going to start the next project which is going to be the closet portion and so I'm going to install this closet here <laughs> closet aka PVC pipes and so I'm going to show you how I'm going to do that honestly I have no idea what I'm doing and this is just an idea I thought up so if it doesn't work I'm sorry don't follow this <laughs> I kind of overestimated how tall I could make it and so really I should have made it a couple inches shorter just because it kind of like dips up right there. I might have to just like run back to Jerry's in order to fix. So I don't know what to do because I have nothing that can cut that. So I got these cut a little too long. These two, I'm gonna get three inches taken off of them. Three inches off of each of them. Yep, and then six off of this one. Yeah. These are finally shorter, so hopefully they will fit just fine in there now. Also, this is the PVC glue, and it took me forever to get this thing off of there. This just goes around the outside of that, and then you just stick it in and let it sit for about 15, 30 seconds. And that's it. And so I'm gonna go around and do that to all the pieces and then we'll nail it in. I have it all glued together now. So I'm just going to nail those in and screw them down and we'll be all set to go with the closet. finished assembling my closet and so I'm going to show you guys what it looks like here. As you can see it's just right inside over my bed, over the vanity here and so I'll be able to hang my clothes as well as under bed storage. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me do these updates to my van. The time for me to move in is getting so close, I'm so nervous, but the more that I put it together, the more I feel like I'm ready. And so now that I have this done, this was something that I thought was gonna take a while and be very tedious, and it did, and it was. <laughs> but it's done now, and I'm very excited. I can start moving some stuff in. It's gonna be super awesome, I'm super excited. So 
Thank you again for watching this. I love you guys. You guys are awesome. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't yet. Next week, I have a package coming in that has some knickknacks and goodies like decorations and stuff for the van. It's going to be a little bit more fun. So stay tuned for that and I'll see you guys next week. Thanks again. Okay, love you. Bye.